today's Toy Spot, we are having a look at the NECA Toys Simpsons 25 of the Grace Guest Stars Series 5, Matt Greening. Or, as he's better known as well, one of the creators of the Simpsons, now in figure treatment. This comes to us from the folks over at NECA Toys. It is recommended for ages 14 and up and does have a choking hazard, as small parts are not recommended for ages 3 and below. Spin around the back of the package. Well, theoretically, you could say Matt Greening has been around as long as The Simpsons have been around. His appearance, however, appears in episode 17 of season 15. The episode was entitled My Big Fat Geek Wedding, an air date of April 18th, 2004. The read-up for the episode says the world-famous creator of Futurama stopped by Springfield to play himself in, in season 15's My Big Fat Geek Wedding. When The Simpsons go to bi-monthly science fiction convention, they see the the genial uh, Mr. Greening chatting up with loyal fans, inviting them to cut locks off his hair, pull his beard, and invade his home for autographs. Uh, other figures available, there is Milhouse Van Houten, Adam West, Lenny Kravitz, Homer Simpson, Tom Petty, Bart Simpson, and Stan Lee. To check out more, you can go to www.necaonline.com. And that being said, Spot's going to take a break. We're going to get this opened up. And when we come back, we're going to get a better look at Matt Greening. There's more anyway, guys. Don't go anywhere. Stay tuned. When you first get uh, Matt Greening out of packaging, you might think to yourself, they've sculpted in the pen to his hand. And luckily, let me put your mind at ease, the pen is removable. Thank goodness for that. You could technically display matte greening without the pen, or you might just even have the pen kept in hand, but I do like that it's a separate piece and not something that was sculpted into his hand. So we'll just put that back. You kind of have to really wiggle to get the pen into his fingertips there. He also does come with a pad of paper, more suitable, I suppose, for autograph signing. And you can also put that into his hand. Uh, from a standpoint of being obviously the creator of Simpsons, even if you're not depicting or displaying him with the idea that he's signing autographs. He is also, after all, the creator, so it could look as if he's coming up with a new episode idea. Uh, his glasses are affixed to his head. They are not removable. You could, I suppose, pull the glasses off, but I wouldn't advise that. Why would you want to? Why would you want to? Figure's quite nice. He's got a personalized jacket that says matte on it. Black jacket with little red stripes, all... Uh, on the bottoms there. And it looks like he's sporting a pair of jeans with possibly, possibly a pair of like Converse tile, uh, style shoes. Uh, displaying him, you could display him all on his own or you can display him next to Fall Out Boy to recreate the episode as Millhouse meets Matt Greening. That's quite, quite nice. Uh, it is also a note too that it seems like the yellow is a little bit different than Millhouse. I thought initially that it was more of a similar, in, in fact, exact yellow, but it does look like Matt Green does have a, maybe a little more of a yellow tone to his skin rather than Milhouse, who appears to be lighter in color. As another example, let's reach off camera and bring in another character that we've already looked at, and that is Bart. Again, the scaling NECA is really, I think, hitting it, hitting the mark when it comes to scale of these figures. One thing I don't think Playmates really... I don't want to keep bashing Playmates, because Playmates, back in the day when they were doing these, they were doing them well. But I think over the years... I don't know. I think I think NECA has done a better scaling, I think, to the size of the figures than the originals. When it comes to Matt Green's articulation... Let's take the pen and, pen and uh, pad of paper out of his hands. There we go. In the way of his articulation... Matt Greening's head does rotate left and right. His arms rotate all the way around. And of course, let's not also forget, he swiveled at his waist. There are, unless you're a, a diehard collector, and uh, I know there's a lot out there, you might be more inclined to probably just pick up the whole series because you love that NECA, like myself, are producing Simpsons figures. On the other hand, you might be just a fan of one said character, I think, over the other. But I think, really, if you like Simpsons, getting a character, a Simpsonized version of Matt Greening, I think it's kind of cool. I think that's neat. I wonder if they'll actually release the other 
Well, I guess they really wouldn't because Matt Groening actually appears in the episode, whereas the other creators may not necessarily, unless you kind of look at the Troy McClure, you know, behind the scenes look at The Simpsons, where again, it's not quite probably how they appear in real life. Neat though to get Matt Groening in figure form. That is a nice touch by NECA. Obviously, it's nice that he appeared in the episode, but it's pretty cool to get him in plastic form as well. Today's Toy Spot, we were having a look at the Simpsons 25 of the Greatest Guest Stars Series 5, Matt Greening. Stay tuned, guys. Spot's going to have more Toy Spots heading your way. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.